there's quite a few extraterrestrials wandering around the humanoid ones. So we've got them walking amongst us. They weren't human at all. These were extraterrestrials standing there examining me in the room. I thought they were very elegant, about seven feet tall. They live aboard their spacecraft, which is sort of in Earth's atmosphere. They would bring me to the planet and introduce me to other kids my age, and we would play together. And I asked him if I could hold his hand. I wanted to know what it felt like to touch them. And I wanted to know it was real. So what you do is you, you take the experiences that people talk about and you operationalize it. How is this even possible uh, that higher dimensional energies can be downloaded or brought down into our ordinary four dimensions of space-time reality? The quantum wave, which is the description of all nature, instantaneously propagated the consciousness of the Houston handler to the moon. This is not an American phenomenon. This is not a Western phenomenon. This is a global phenomenon. There's not only thousands, there's potentially millions of people out there that are living this double life. They will lead us into telepathic abilities. They will lead us into abilities to heal ourselves, to literally change our body. DNA treatment number two. What's interesting is the actual uh, number, the magnitude of the changes that I've been seeing in the past when energy treats the DNA. This is a robust, strong effect. There are layers of codes. There's thousands of codes layered on top of each other. You touch one part, it touches 10 other parts. All of this information is actually following lines. It comes through this multidimensional grid system. This means interdimensional information is going to happen instantly in locations like these. Human DNA in our body can exist as a toroid to bring in higher dimensional energies into our physical body, convert them into electromagnetic fields, which then the body can use to regulate the physiological and biochemical processes associated with humans. I believe this is the theory of everything.